We recently covered the astonishing discovery made deep within a coal mine under Rostov in Russia. Fortunately photographed by Mr. Kasatkin, an experienced safety engineer, who discovered the prints of what clearly appears to have been left by chariot's wheels. These seemingly impossible prints are, thankfully, not the only unexplained artifacts to have been found deep within the mines of Earth. In 1912, workers shoveling coal in the municipal electric plant in Thomas, Oklahoma, would make an equally important discovery. As they were breaking up the large lumps of coal in preparation for the furnaces, to their surprise, a small iron pot would be ejected from one of the chunks. Several experts would examine the iron pot over the following few days, all declaring it to be genuine. Apparently, the imprint of the pot could also still be clearly seen in the broken chunks of coal that had encased it for, in all possibility, millions of years. According to Robert O. Fay of the Oklahoma Geological Survey, the Wilburton Mines coal, in which the pot was found, is an incredible 312 million years old. The cup is now displayed at a private museum in southern Missouri. It was fortunately photographed by Robert Nordling, who sent a copy to Frank Lewis Marsh, Emeritus Professor of Biology at Andrews University in Berrien Springs, on 10 January 1949. He forwarded the images to Wilbert H. Rush in 1971. Rush was a professor of biology at Concordia College. This means that we now have several artifacts we know to be in existence, which, according to modern understanding as to the age of coal, are over 300 million years old. The pot is still within a private collection of an unknown collector.